okay welcome back to Dave Hostel Mountain Man and we're out today to do the first walk of 2022 um, it's one I've already done before but I haven't recorded um, Grisdale Pike is the target I may turn that into a Coaldale horseshoe and walk right round the valley but uh, it was all about getting out of Carlisle and back into the outdoors today because I think November was my last mountain climb and uh, the fitness has really been dropping I have been moving house in that time so I do have reasonable excuses but uh, but no this is the first one I did last year and it's not too taxing um, after the initial ascent but yeah, so we've got our first initial look of Bassinth way there started this walk just outside the village of Braithwaite which is down at the bottom there and we're looking out to Doddwood and Skiddo in the background and uh, yeah I think I'm the only one here at the moment I just got here at the crack of dawn and uh, yeah one of the quieter mountains of the Lake District. It is Friday today so I'd expect some of the uh, bigger ones like Skiddo, Scorfell and Wasdale in particular to be kind of busy as it's a weekend which is fair enough so I've decided to come and do this one which is out the way and let me say not too taxing even though I'm breathing heavily now but uh, let's get rid of all the toxins built up from living in the city for the last two months so yeah you've got the little village of Braithwaite just here and in the distance you've got Keswick um, the edge of Derwent water there amazing the route is just a straightforward path pretty much the whole way um, very grassy so it has rained it's usually pretty slippy uh, particularly when coming down I've gone over my ass a few times on here um, but yeah it's nothing too taxing a little bit tricky near the summit there's a minor hands-on rock moment but no nothing nothing anybody with a dog even couldn't overcome really but, uh, yeah so yeah you can see the path clearly defined through this uh, hillside here cut into the grass really now that we're on the main sort of ridge side but, uh, it is steep but because it's grass it's quite comfortable to walk on and uh, oh, you've got these magnificent views it's hard to feel truly remote in this area because the huge town of Keswick just there but 
it'll do for a starter. Normally when I stop and do a bit to the camera, it's normally something spectacular that I've got to show you. And uh, I never really show people what you've got to go through to get those spectacular views. Yeah, you cut bits like this out, which is just, yeah. Head down and get up, get up the bloody hillside. I'm so tired of the same old lines we rehearse and rhyme, but don't believe. Ain't it time that we speak our minds and just realize we're meant to be? Say you want to and we'll leave tonight. Say the word, it's up to you. But I think we both know how these things go. Just say you want to. Now I'm not sure what tomorrow holds, but we'll never know unless we try. So take my hand, baby, don't let go And with a little hope we'll be alright Say you want to and we'll leave tonight Say the word, it's up to you But I think we both know how these things go I know, I know, you, you wake up in the morning and you know very well where you're going and you ask your brain, hmm, do I need a poo? No, fine. Well, you get to the bloody mountain and your brain goes, yeah, Dave, you remember that poo didn't need earlier? We need it now. I don't know if it's the change in air pressure or the cold weather, but it's metal. Mountain is, but no, no, you have to, you have to wait. You can't shit on a mountain, no, because it like ruins the area for everybody. Really, I think tip number one. I think more than bring a course. You wake up, you go to do a mountain. So yeah, we're coming up to the, probably the most tricky part of Rysdale Pike because the path does go up these um, rocks here. Um, so it's a wet day like today, so you just got to make sure your footing is uh, solid before you put any weight onto it. And then, uh, yeah, just, there's plenty of places to 
attach yourself to, but just one hand on the rock. Make sure your foot in this solid and then push up. Mainly using your arm because at least if your arm slips you've still got your legs. Um, that's how I do it. So yeah, it's just picking your way up. And the path appears again. in long lost times ago close my eyes so I can see the light time stands still while the sun goes round distant winds making silent sounds daylight waiting to come relieve the night so let it here that I could have chosen to do today but without views and the winds pretty strong it's really cold today um, I'm not gonna bother so I'm just taking the shot but like I say it's been two months nearly since my last mountain climb on high street and I did feel like I was coming to a crux where if I didn't get back out again soon that could have been it you know been in that situation before with gym memberships uh, you join a gym you go what two three times a week in the beginning and you do that for several weeks and then there's that one day where you think nah not today and that becomes two days you don't go and then it, it just it, it cascades it's a snowball effect and Right, we're in the valley now. I was 
like how the water gets to that river and it's at the beginning this is probably the source of it here just uh literal water gushing out of the mountain must uh must be absolutely packed of water that mountain doesn't look like it's letting up anytime soon so yeah that's probably the source i think it breaks up through this valley here actually the river but i guess that's one of the sources for this yeah that's us coming down onto the uh the old slate mine now we're descending drysdale pike uh, the route now is just you can see it etched into the side of the valley there right down back to the car park in braithwaite so i'll sign off the video from here first one of 2022 thank you for watching as ever um appreciate it um take care of yourselves and i'll see you on the next one peace